Okay, today I'm going to show you how to make a romantic homopolar motor. Now everyone knows that romance is awesome and everyone knows that electric motors are awesome. So just imagine the awesomeness when you bring the two of them together. So the romantic homopolar motor sounds complicated but it's really simple to make. All you need is a battery. Uh, this is a D cell, you can use any size you like, AA, whatever, it doesn't matter. Uh, and then you need some neodymium magnets or one neodymium magnet. It needs to be a disc or a rod shape and you stick that onto the negative terminal of your battery. The only other thing you need really is a piece of copper wire. Now obviously you'll start off with a straight piece of copper wire and then your task is to bend that into a heart shape. Now you can do that by hand. I, on the other hand, have produced a little template here which allows me to knock these things out by the bucket load. Actually, can we, can we cut that bit about the buckets because my wife might get the wrong idea about that. She possibly won't understand. Is that okay? Yeah? Right. Okay, so I've produced a template. So basically what you have to do is get you a piece of straight copper wire, lay it over the top, use a screwdriver carefully so it doesn't jab you in the hand to push the middle of the copper wire down into the v-shape of the heart you then bend the ends around the heart shape like this and then wrap them opposite directions around the bottom of the tube now you can trim those to size once you've taken the thing off but remember copper wire is quite springy so when you take it off the template it might actually spring a bit out of shape, so you probably will have to just bend it back so that it fits onto your particular battery and set of magnets. You can use aluminium wire, two millimeter aluminium modeling wire is great because you can cut it with scissors and it's not quite as springy as the copper is, so you don't get a problem with it bouncing out of shape. Uh, and that's basically all there is to it. A pair of pliers might come in handy, but they're not essential. When you finish, battery, magnets, heart shape, Simply put them together like that, the perfect Valentine's gift. What more could your loved one want? 